and everybody welcome back to all things jazzy if you're new here go ahead and subscribe turn on your post notifications and give this video a thumbs up so today we're going to be painting some chocolate covered strawberries they are so so pretty let's go ahead and get into it okay so i'm going to be using some highlighter dust by the sugar art this is the gold highlighter dust and i'm going to be using this baby pink as well Okay, so to turn this into a liquid form to make it easy for painting, I'm going to be using some lemon extract. You can use alcohol as well, like vodka, as long as it's 40 proof. So I have these little containers. I do use these as reusable. I keep the lids to go to them. I got these containers from the Dollar Tree. So I'm going to go ahead and add some lemon extract into here just a little bit. A little goes a long way with this dust, um, you guys, to make the paint. I'm going to be adding just a paintbrush full, <laughs> a paintbrush full of this highlighter dust, this gold. And we're just going to go ahead and mix it up. Okay, so once that is good for painting, I am going to go ahead and grab one of my chocolate covered strawberries. I did go ahead and pre-dip these before the video for the second time. I don't like really, really long videos, but I did link below um, another video of how I dip my chocolate covered strawberries. Okay, so you're just going to start just from the top to the bottom. The painting is really easy. So it's actually really fun and relaxing, but just make sure you get full coverage on your berries. And I'm just going over some that's showing the, the paint brush strokes just to cover that up. All right, that goes one, that goes that one. Okay, so this one I am only going to color the um, chocolate portion. And then the other side you'll see me color later with the baby pink highlighter dust. So I'm just going to carefully paint this side just to make sure that I don't get the gold onto the pink. Okay, so this is not as gold as I want it to be. So I'm gonna go ahead and add some more lemon extract to my little container or jar here um, and mix it up. And then I'm just gonna add another layer of gold onto this strawberry. Closed, I 
Okay, so I'm going to get a different paintbrush now and I'm going to do just the same as you see me do with the highlighter, the gold highlighter dust. So I'm going to take a little bit on my paintbrush, dump it into this little container or yeah, we're going to call this a container and pour a little bit of lemon extract in there and mix it up until it becomes a liquid paint form. So always start with a, a small amount of the lemon extract. And if you happen to pour too much of the extract into the container, um, you can always just add more powder to even it out. Alright, so now that it's at a liquid form, I'm just going to go ahead and again do the same thing. Just brush the paint on. Um, this one I did make a little bit more liquidy or <laughs> the paint is really thin. Uh, but that's, the, that's what I was aiming for. I just wanted the pink ones just to have more of like a shimmer effect to it. Um, it's not going to look exactly like the gold one does. Gold kind of pops more, but I want the pink to be poppy too. This goes on so pretty, everybody. This pink is already so pretty to me. Um, I absolutely love pink. Pink is my favorite color. Probably all shades. I probably can do like a 50 shades of pink and I wouldn't be able to pick which one I like the best. Okay, so here is another half fairy that I'm about to paint. All right, so I'm just gonna paint this um, side half, this pink one. You can notice that I did switch my brush too when I went off camera. Um, I switched to a smaller one because that big one was not gonna work for this one. I'm just gonna paint the side pink and then I'm gonna go ahead and go back in and paint the other side gold. I don't know how I missed this one earlier with the milk chocolate side. I thought I grabbed all of these, but that's okay. We'll just backtrack. Okay, so here is that one I painted earlier that I told you guys you would see later in the video when I paint the pink side. So I am going to just paint the pink side being really careful not to um, get any pink on the go. Okay, so now that all the strawberries are painted, um, I am going to just add some drizzle. I just thought this would just make it look a little bit more prettier, so I'm adding pink drizzle to all of the strawberries. They look so cute. Okay, look how pretty they are. So they all have drizzle now, and here is the finished product. They are so pretty, so elegant, and just super, super cute, you guys. All right, that is the end 